what's going on with 5G? Like I saw some really cool labs stuff where they basically yeah. said it's going to be real time. It's going to be insane fast. And I want to know what your take is on it. Yeah. Um, well, I'll give you my, uh, my, my take on 5G. So 5G is a, uh, it's both a radio access evolution. So like antennas and radios in the network and also on the core. And it, from a customer benefit standpoint, it's really, well, it's threefold. So one is it does bring uh, incredible speeds, like 15x speed. So think 450 uh, as like an average download speed um, on a device or in your home. I mean, your average broadband connection is what, by 30? Um, so yeah. think, you know, 10x of that. Uh, it is a, uh, a huge um, advance in speed. Now, uh, we don't have a lot of use cases that demand that right now um, because you can only, your 1080 is only 1080. So um, but it does allow for uh, use cases like VR, like AR, uh, and doing it wirelessly without being wired into your, uh, to, your, um, uh, to your desktop or a, a gaming computer. So that, that's one evolution. The other one is incredibly low latency. So the, the standard allows, I mean, it requ kind of requires us to be able to support latencies down as, as, as low as 10 milliseconds. So think the ability to get real-time information in autonomous vehicles or in and things that would require response times that we can't possibly support today uh, with our wireless infrastructure. And the last, which is probably the most cited use case is IOT. So uh, billions and billions of connected devices um, provisioned instantly across our, our environment. So smart buildings, smart cities, you know, asset tracking, all those things that uh, the IOT solution space is gonna produce for us as consumers all gets unlocked uh, with 5G.